All right. <laughs> My memory card was full, so we got cut off on that last video. Anyway, uh, I kind of put these in kind of small piles. So you may need a little bit bigger piles. Just read your directions and kind of see where all you're going to use each mix, and then you can be able to judge how much you're going to need. But uh, let's go ahead and mix this. This is the burgundy. Okay, there we go. There's the burgundy. Wipe off my knife. Okay. That's a little hard to do one handed. Okay, then we will mix the green with a whole different knife. <laughs> have you noticed one common ingredient in each one of these piles see if you can say it before I do there's your green the common ingredient is raw sienna that's the mother color in this project. Let's mix the yellow oxide. Yellow oxide is a dirty yellow. And now we'll mix the red. Use both reds, the one leaning towards the orange side and one leaning toward the blue side, and we use the raw sienna as the mother color and toner. And what we get is a, is a neutral toned red. Alright, and then the last mix we're going to do is that of the background color, the light beige. It's always easier to go darker than it is to go lighter, so we start out with a whole lot of the white and just small amounts of the toner color raw sienna and then the other toner color which is raw umber. Okay, there's your mixes for this week's project.